So this is a demo of the rig we made. It's a two degree of freedom vibratory system with a dynamic absorber, as you can see here. Um, just to show you the basic bits, first we take the bottom mass off, which is just a spring and a mass, and we start up the system. It's got a variable drive here, so see we can speed it up, and when you speed it up, nothing happens. When you slow it down too much, it'll go too slow for it to vibrate, but when you get it in, a certain sweet spot speed it starts to uh, vibrate as it, at its resonant frequency which we adjusted the masses to uh, get to that point so let's just get it up there because we used a pretty good sized mass it gets a pretty good displacement okay and now if we did our calculations right and we turn this off and we attach our DVA to the bottom of it. We should see a canceling of the movement of the platform and the transfer of all the energy down to the uh, bottom mass, which is uh, what you can see down here. Now, of course, since this is a dynamic vibratory system, you get also uh, some different characteristics when you add a second mass. So if you slow it down, you can start to get movement again. Uh, it's going to have a lower resonant frequency now, where both masses will move a little bit and uh, more notably the upper resonant frequency is where you start running into a lot of troubles. Uh, the mode shape here is opposite directions and if you let it go far enough it'll start smashing and hit the bottom mass off of the rig. So yeah, that's the uh, dynamic vibratory rig.